Okay, today we're doing a fitment on a 2023 X5M competition. All right, these are the two screws you're going to remove. Uh, they have a 10 millimeter head on them. All right, so now uh, you're going to uh, take the bracket, line it up these two holes with these two holes, and then look where the 3M tape's gonna be, and you're gonna use the pad that's provided, the cleaning pad, and clean this area. This is foam tape, but you'll have 3M tape. You'll take the 3M tape off, then take the factory screws, and put them, line it up, try to keep the, uh, don't let it stick yet until you get the second screw in. And once you get the second screw started, then it'll line everything up. So then as you tighten it up, the 3M tape will, you'll see what it'll draw up. And then, you know, you can just push it and it'll stick. And it's more just there to give it a little more security. But the, these two screws are more than strong enough to hold that bracket. So there you go. And you're going to take the front plate, slide it in, start it. And then once it gets going, just push it in until it clicks into place. There you go. We're going to now show you how to mount the license plate to the uh, front bracket. You're going to take your plate, take the screw, put it through the plate, then line it up on the bracket, like so. Put the nylon lock nut on it. Now the nylon lock nut will have a nylon ring and then no ring so the ring goes to the outside so when you put it on make sure the ring goes to the outside and then you just repeat for the other three screws and then take your 10 millimeter socket or wrench if you have just a wrench Phillips screwdriver and just tighten them up Again, these don't have to be super tight because the nylon lock uh, ring in there is going to keep it from rattling off. So there you go. That should, should look like when you're all done.